Just over 140 years, the Earth's temperature has risen by 1.1 degrees Celsius. Heat waves, droughts and deadly floods are just a snippet of what awaits us as a result of global warming. The United Nations IPCC is releasing the final report from their sixth climate change assessment cycle on Monday. Our world is at the crossroads and our planet is in the crosshairs. We are nearing the point of no return, of overshooting the internationally agreed limit of 1.5 degrees Celsius of global warming. We are at the tip of a tipping point. But it is not too late. I count on the IPCC to do what you have always done, point the way to solutions, and show the urgent need to end global heating with cold, hard facts. The world's top climate scientists and representatives of countries have spent a week in Switzerland condensing 10,000 pages of academic research from the last seven years into a 20-page warning for world leaders. It's a summary of all of their major reports featuring the science of climate change, current impacts of the climate crisis and potential solutions. Some of the warnings include at least 3.3 billion people will be affected by global warming. 14% of species will face extinction if the Earth's temperature rises by 1.5 degrees, and by 2050, cities will be experiencing annual disasters that would have previously occurred every 100 years. Solutions recommend rapid reductions in greenhouse gas emissions across all sectors, with the collective aim of attaining a carbon-neutral world by 2050. Experts are warning that a lack of action could lead to irreversible changes to our planet in the long term. Uh, it's not only a short-term crisis. It's, we are talking really about a short to medium and long-term crisis. So every step is important. Not only like, you know, an emergency relief now, we also need to widely think about our intervention for the medium-term support and long-term support. For climate scientists, this final report is their last chance to call for action before the next report in 2030, by which time it will be too late to act.